Hello, I'm Norman Swan. Welcome to another Health Minute. Could testosterone be an elixir of youth? Well, certainly some women think so, and a lot of them are taking it to improve their libido, although there's some doubt that it actually works. A lot of men are tempted to take testosterone as well, because a drop in testosterone levels matches the shriveling of our bits and brains as we age. So why not give it a go, say some, and build back our muscles and minds? So popular is this idea, at least in the United States, that authorities there have been encouraging trials of testosterone, and the largest of its kind to date has recently been published. It still wasn't that large, only 220 healthy men, but they had lower than average testosterone levels for their age, which was about 67. They were randomly allocated to 160 milligrams of testosterone a day or placebo for about six months, and they had a battery of mental and physical tests done. Basically, testosterone was a bit of a fizzer. Thinking ability, mobility, muscle strength didn't change, and that was even though lean body mass went up. Waist circumference didn't budge, nor did bone density. The good form of cholesterol went down, which was a bit of a worry, although glucose and insulin levels favoured the testosterone group. A longer trial with more men might have shown bigger benefits. It also might have shown greater harms. So it's fair to say that in healthy ageing men, taking testosterone isn't worth the time or the money. Thank you.